Centuries have passed. But our order has remained steadfast in its sacred mission to preserve the balance between man and half-breed. Such was the quest of our founder, King Arthur. May his name be forever resplendent. Is it true? Did the Lord Chancellor fight by Arthur's side? That is the legend. Today, that balance is threatened with grave upset by a new contagion. The rebellion. As long as its campaign of anarchy and terror is allowed to continue, the plague of lichen infestation that has infected our city will only grow more intolerable. Well, the Lord Chancellor will thus agree to the urgency of a mission into Whitechapel. Whitechapel is a matter for the civil authorities. When the noble Arthur sought to contest for truage with the Roman Emperor Lucius, he did not trouble himself with issues of jurisdiction. Do not presume to quote history to me, Sir Percival. I've seen more of history than you shall ever know. I remind the knights here assembled that the threat to this order comes not only from without, but within. We must stand vigilant together lest our ranks be poisoned by those who seek the destruction of all we hold sacred. No one is immune from the rebels' influence. Surely the Lord Chancellor does not mean to question Sir Percival's loyalty. This order has long appreciated Sir Percival's counsel, but the current disruption calls for caution and concerted effort, not rash action. Sir Percival has cause, Lord Chancellor. The situation in Whitechapel may need to be addressed. Does Lord Darwin speak with the blessing of the peers? Lord Hastings, Lord Dunglass. He does, Lord Chancellor. Perhaps the question should be put to the council. Very well. What says the order of Her Majesty's royal knights in the matter of Whitechapel? Aye or nay? Nay! nay. The nays have it. This council is dismissed. Our order grows too prudent, Grayson. We wither away from this inaction. Leave it, Sebastian. Caution be damned. Sir Percival is most agitated. You should learn it is best not to cross him when his mind is set on something. What do you make of this? Percival seems intent on pursuing his investigation. You heard the Lord Chancellor. The Council will not stand for it. Brother Knight has made a habit of I remind you of your place, Lady Egwene. Who are you to question the Council's wisdom? Yes, Lord Chancellor. Do you believe the evidence enough to warrant our involvement? We have worked with less than that in the past. We haven't always been. Galahad will deal with this in due time. I have a more pressing matter to attend. As you wish. How many of us will make the journey to America? Oh, uh, Lord Barrett, Lord Darwin, and myself. I've heard many great things about the Agamemnon, Lord Hastings. Oh, she is the finest the United India Company has ever built. I can promise you a pleasant and speedy journey across the Atlantic. Can we expect your presence at the launch, Sir Lucan? It would be my honor to see you off on your maiden voyage, my lords. Sir Lucan, if I may. Um, if you'd permit me, my lord. Of course, it's a personal. Alistair, you know as well as I do that Whitechapel is the key to these disturbances, to everything. My opinion is immaterial. The council has spoken. Few dared countermand your father's express wishes. Need I remind you that we all serve at the Lord Chancellor's pleasure? You are the knight commander! Make him see reason. You think an incursion into a rebel stronghold is reasonable? I consider it an acceptable risk. One for which you'd be willing to accept full responsibility should unforeseen circumstances arise. Let what befalls be upon my head. No one else's. 
Whitechapel remains off limits. That is officially. You have my thanks, Sir Logan. Of your thanks, I have no need. Bring me results. As the Knight Commander wishes. Well, we're going in. Most excellent. When do we move? You're not talking about Whitechapel. But my Your brother sought fit to permit us a reconnaissance. Secure the necessary materials. Isabeau, a word. Tell me, monsieur, about the Lord Chancellor. What is it, Marquis? Sir Lucan and Lady Egraine were adopted by him, yes? As they were. Why would he bring them into such struggle? Perhaps he wanted to regain a semblance of the humanity he lost. When time came to join the Order, the choice was theirs to make. Regardless, I will not wish this life on my children. Marquis, we need to hurry. Oui, mon général, avec plaisir. Monsieur. Friend Mallory has always been something of a rogue operative. I've never known a better man. Still, I shall rely on you to be a, call it a sobering influence. Sebastian and I have long been partners. I trust him with my life. A little restraint would not be ill-advised. Do look after my sister, won't you? No man in the realm can keep Isabeau from danger when she's of a mind. Oh, you say true. What's a brother to do, eh? Good luck and Godspeed. How do you mean? Always at your service, Sir Galahad. This way, please. Ah, Tesla. Just the man. What new developments do you have to show me? Quite a few intriguing things, if I may say so. Any further news of the uh, trouble in Grosvenor Square? Police are investigating. And investigating. Lichens on the United India Company's front doorstep. What do you make of it? Mayfair isn't what it used to be. Uh, permit me to oversee a few of my new experiments. Uh, in the meanwhile, take a look around. Uh, play with whatever strikes your fancy. But do be careful. I also believe we ever use these communicators. We are uncertain as to why. Um, let's engage the unit. Start with the uh, 18 and Hmm. All gibberish to me. Nicola, you sly dog. Nicola, how fares your friend Edison these days? Thomas and I are not on speaking terms. 
The man is an idiot! Uh, Sir Galahad! Please, this way. Here is something you may find interesting. This device allows you to convert between Edison's inefficient direct current and my superior alternating current. Quite handy for overloading and incapacitating certain electrical systems. It's comprised of an inverter, transformer and rectifier outfitted with some brass clips to enhance the design. Oh, and a fine leather carrying case. Uh, inside each tube is a small quantity of mercury. When the mercury is properly aligned, the device becomes operational. Please, try it. You never cease to amaze, Nicola. I'd appreciate your expert opinion on my latest whimsy. Here. S684 Marksman Carbine. Impressive. You've always had a good eye for craftsmanship. I've outfitted this one with a telescopic sight. It's ideal for long-range shooting. I would be honored if uh, you would test its efficacy. With pleasure. Your skills never cease to amaze me. Good shot. Nicely balanced. Recoil is sharp. Skills never cease to amaze. Good shot. Nicely balanced. Recoil is sharp, but manageable. Some muffling might be in order as well. I'll attend to it immediately. So, are there any other of my children that you would like to meet? The offer's tempting, but I must return to the others. Of course. Oh, the monocular that uh, General Lafayette requested is over there on the table. I'll see that he gets it. We scour the district in pairs. Isabeau, you and Lafayette take the high street from the south end. Galahad and I will move in from the north. Why not give the Frenchman to Galahad? Mademoiselle doubts my intentions. I promise to remain at all times the picture of chivalry. I'd prefer to have someone more experienced looking out for me. I thought you needed no looking after. Very well. You team with Galahad. Mademoiselle will perhaps one day allow me to demonstrate my skill. One day. Remember, we are entering rebel territory. The insurgents will take umbrage at our incursion into Whitechapel. Give an little discovery in Mayfair. 
The London hospital should be our target. Strange to think Lycans would find sanctuary here, is it not, monsieur? You really believe the rebels are collaborating with the half-breeds? The Lord Chancellor is convinced of it. I have my doubts. Do you trust anyone, Mon General? Never accept. Always question. It's a motto that's seen me through the centuries. Stay vigilant, all of you. We can expect hot work here. Ah, quelle joie! A nest of cut purses, collaborators and whoremongers. I knew it very differently once. A lone chapel stood just there, offering sanctuary to travelers. That was before even my time. The city walls had yet to come up. Now you can smell white chapel before this. Nothing is as it used to be, Sebastian. True. The order least of all. We rendezvous at the hospital. Stay on your guard. Understood. This way, monsieur. Doesn't look good. He ain't getting up. Stay down, you stupid git. Poor mortals by sending her precious knights to prowl our streets and violate our homes in the name of law and order! Yeah. Where is the law, I ask you? Yeah. Yeah. I'll tell you where. Yeah. Dead and buried! And where there is no law, the people must rise up! Rise up and fight! Reclaim their rights! They tell you things have never been better. They tell you England is making progress. What's all We've this progress brought Let's to move. Hideous slums, some no more than crannies of obscure misery. Long hours in factories, only to be paid a pittance and told by your masters to be I'm grateful sorry. for Who a few bob a week. I don't know. I swear. Work to the bone in a black hell of coal mines while the captains of industry... She's dead because of you! <laughs> <laughs> Didn't care to dirty your aristocratic hands. It's all right. There's no need to be afraid. How could I have known he was the Ripper? He was just another bloke. He killed another one last night. A 
didn't die. Leave her be, monsieur. I didn't, didn't die. Stop. Don't worry. You're safe now. We should head through this door. No weapons allowed in the establishment. You want to stay, you leave it here. Bien sûr, monsieur. As a matter of fact, we were just looking for the code closet. Give it here. And a fun, governor. At ease, monsieur. A quick reconnaissance of the premises seems imperative. Join me upstairs now. Another time. I can show you things you've never seen before. Oh, I don't doubt. Marky, this is no time for sport. We have to find a way out of here quickly. All right. I have just a thing, monsieur. If one of you ladies would reach into my pocket. Give it here, love. Is it sufficient, monsieur? <laughs> More than sufficient, I'd say. Upstairs, then, if you please. Are you about ready, love? You won't forget this, I tell you. This way, love. Get in here. Oi! Here! What are you up to? You're in the wrong room. Where's the little frog gone? He's in there. We're his friend. Oi! Get out of there! Toutes mes excuses, madame. Intruder. Get your weapons. Let's go.
Looks like we've stirred the nest. Keep a lookout, Marquis. I need to find a way through here. I shall be there. Two shorts for bobbies, one long for nights. Damn nights. I'm sure it's not the other way round. <gasps> yeah. Two shorts for nights and one long for bobbies. Does it matter? Just keep your eyes open for Eva. Well, I mean, if it's nights, shouldn't we get some help? Well, obviously, if we see any of those black guys skulking around down there. Well, <laughs> you grab him down! <laughs> Clear! Perhaps the rooftops are not our best path, monsieur. You may be right. We need to find another way to the hospital. I found a way out. Facile, hein? I sense that we are not welcome here. Keep your eyes open. We don't want to create any further commotion. Look, monsieur. God did not save this queen. Lafayette, keep your head down. We need to take out the snow.
Marshal Galahad. Rebel neutralized. Lafayette, take the streets. We. Oui. Let's head up. Go, move in. In the tunnel, my son. Hold them up. Enemy down! We have to keep moving. I imagine more rebels are on their way. Hey! Help me with the cops! They blocked the way! Started. Through the building! down. I'm being pinned down.
Rebel down! We need to keep moving and get off the streets. A little help with the wagon, monsieur? Purcell, Purcell, do you read me? Save your breath, monsieur. The buildings are blocking the signal. The curse of progress. Am you monocular? I can see our target. The hospital is two miles west. Do you see our comrades? Not yet. There. It must be them. Shall we join the soirée? Let's invite a few friends, shall we? Air Command, this is Galahad. I need response from anyone in the vicinity of Whitechapel. Air Command, this is Galahad. Think, Monsieur. Monsieur Coffee. Coffee. We are without sanction here. The Lord Chancellor will be most displeased. Lafayette does not fancy a court-martial. We'll worry about that later. Mr. Galahad, this is Sentinel-5. We are three leagues northeast of Whitechapel. Please state directives. Sentinel-5, this is Galahad. We require air support on standby. Acknowledge, Sir Galahad. We are signaling blue-red at a one-second interval. We request your visual confirmation for heading change.
Galahad, this is Sentinel-5. We have visual confirmation of your position. Heading change to 224 degrees. Assuming holding pattern above Whitechapel in eight minutes. Acknowledge Sentinel-5. Await further orders at location. Let's go.